Well, welcome in, ladies and gentlemen, to this, the North Shore Squash Club and to the National Senior Championships in Auckland and a fantastic day, a fantastic three days of squash on court now for the women's final. Are the top seeds, you can see Emma Miller, the right-hander, and the top seed up against Abby Palmer. She is the second seed, and she is the left-hander, and should be a very exciting contest. And Shelley Kitchen, great to have you with me as well. The New Zealand High Performance Manager and former top 10 player. Shelley, this should be a really exciting contest between these two top seeds. Yeah, I, I think it's going to be a great match. Emma had a great um, semi, sorry, Abby had a great semi finals yesterday, played well against Lana Harrison um, to come through in, in four games. Emma Miller played Sophie Hodges in the semi finals and, and won in three there. So, um, yeah, I think it's going to be a really great contest today. And we Last saw in time. that first point there, the slight down orthodox away from the body shot, which worked for Emma Miller. However, now we are at 2-1. And uh, just uh, the scoreboard's just going to catch up with us very shortly. Nice play there by Emma Miller. She really likes to hit it. It stays hit, whereas uh, Abby Palmer, I mean, she certainly likes to uh, play a quick point using the angles very nicely as the left-hander holds the ball very well. Shelley, is there anything in particular we should be watching out for between these two? We know that they like to, they're not going to grind it out, are they? They're going to play winners. No, they're not. I think you like to see in the first game, they're sort of both working out each other's game plan, I guess. They've played each other a lot, so they do know the way each other um, plays. Um, last time they met was the PSA National Squash Centre final about about four weeks ago, and, and Emma had a win there. So, um, yeah, anything, we know anything around the middle of the court, anything loose, both, both girls are going to try and go for a winning shot, um, probably to the front of the court. So, that's, oh, that's it's nice. a great shot from Emma. So Emma's at the moment just getting really good length, and yes. no answer for Abby at the moment. There's that lob serve, which she's uh, got to use a lot. It's really a, a weapon. For a lot of players, you wouldn't consider it a weapon, but for Emma, it certainly is. And uh, the stroke there. Yeah, so Abby's trying to move Emma to the front of the court. Um, I'm not sure it's probably a really good idea, I, I think, in the first <laughs> game. Um, you know, Emma's going to try and get onto that ball, ball pretty early to the front of the court. So Abby started pretty similar yesterday in the first game, moving Lana to the front of the court, and Lana was actually onto it quite early. Well, I'm just looking for the respective coaches in the crowd, and it is a very good crowd. and making it very warm. A nice shot there from uh, Emma Miller. And Paul Hornsby working with Abby Palmer out of the North Shore Club. I'm not sure who's actually working with uh, Emma Miller at the moment. Uh, I think her, bro her brother's probably goodbye. coaching her today and her parents are up here from, from Wellington as well. So got a team of supporters, team of coaches probably helping her today. I'm not sure about uh, Zach with some of his unorthodox shots, whether he wants to teach her that and whether Emma would allow that either. I don't know if she'll listen to her little brother. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> but yeah, I, I think Abby's probably looks a bit nervous at the moment. She probably needs to play into her way into a little bit if Emma gives her time. Emma likes to play pretty quick rallies, and before, we, before you know it, you can be one love down. This is the um, longest rally of the um, of the game so far. So great retrieving there oh. from Emma. Well, she was up close to the wall and had an option of driving it down the wall. Instead, decided to go across, and Palmer was able to get that back. But uh, she managed to recover well and won the point. Yeah, she's looking to um, move. Abby side to side, I think, flicking it past Abby, getting Abby turning into the back corners and also moving her to the front. So, yeah, Emma reads the game very well. She reads very, uh, patterns of play very well. Oh, that ball uh, certainly <laughs> remained low. <laughs> I don't think there was any way of picking that one up. Shall we do think, there, I think. Do you think there's added pressure that there's no Joelle, no Amanda who would be the favourites and that there really isn't much of a favourite between these two. It probably adds pressure that this is the first title. One of them is going to win the first title for many, many years. Yeah, definitely. I think um, yeah, it's, it's always going to be um, close matches in, in the men's and the, and the women's um, games today. 
It's probably one of the closest competitions we've had um, probably in a few years in, in the Nationals this year. Just flicking that one off her toes. Nice change of direction again. So Abby using that boast again. Like that was eight all there, a, a big point. I feel like Abby's just oh. giving it away there. Yeah, yeah, she didn't seem to put as much effort into that particular shot as she could have. And so the first game going to Emma Miller, the uh, top seed over Abby Palmer, 11-8. And a packed crowd here enjoying themselves with a number of matches so far today. So 11-8, there's the crowd. And more up the top as well, it's certainly very warm. So Emma Miller taking the first game, 11-8. Well, Shelley Kitchen back in for this, the second game, and nothing that we could grab hold of in that first. I mean, Emma Miller just did a few little things better, but it wasn't decisive, was it? Yeah, I think um, Abby was just taking Emma in to the front of the court too much. It, Emma would then have an outright winner, or um, Abby would be hitting the tin. So pretty much Abby started similar yesterday, um, pretty slow in the first game, and, and then really picked it up. But with Emma's sort of experience, um, you know, and confidence, it's going to yeah, it's going to be pretty hard. And there's going to be a lot of Emma likes the quick points yeah, as well. I mean, before you turned around, she's virtually serving again. Uh, we do have uh, Abby Palmer. Just turned 23 a couple of days ago, whereas uh, Emma Miller, I think, 29. When it comes to PSA World Rankings, it's 112, 113. Doesn't mean really anything, does it? <laughs> Can't really get much closer no. than that. Um, I think it's also yeah. the, just the different styles. The left-hander, the right-hander can create options. Yeah. Well, Abby had the option there to put it pretty much anywhere. wasn't needed. We haven't quite seen the emotion on uh, Emma's face. Usually you're getting a whole lot of emotions and smiling. Perhaps the final's taken that away. She's doing the uh, the poker face on this occasion. Yeah, she's pretty serious today. Yeah. As you would be in the national final. So, yeah. It's a great lob. The frame. Oh, nice shot. Interesting how on that straight drive on the backhand, she ends up dropping her racket away. I mean, she's already hit the shot, so I guess it doesn't matter too much, but it does drop away towards her body. Oh, that's a great shot by yeah. Emma. Her length was really, really good. Um, it was the length, not game. the pace on that, was it? It was just so deep that wow. it was effective. Great shot by Abby there, boast off the serve. Well, not seeing uh, many long rallies, but then we didn't expect too many, did we? <laughs> Oh, it's pretty fast and furious. I can hardly keep up <laughs> yeah, exactly. with what's going on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, if these two did go to five, it would be the fastest five gamer that we've seen. So Abby calling for a let there. She wasn't really sure, but Abby doesn't I really no. usually ask, ask for me. But no. um, she was committed to the shot. That's oh, a nice shot. Oh. Well done. Oh, good Back retrieving from Emma. Oh, oh, shot. Oh, well played from uh, Emma Miller there. Recovered it very well. Yeah, I think Abby's length is just a little bit too short at the moment. Like, that was a really great um, retrieval. But then that, that ball's before the service box line, and it's just one step for Emma there. So, and that's oh, yeah. uh, that shot. So, out to the 7-4 lead, the three-point buffer now. Just a little bit of height on the serve, but not quite the usual lob serve. And uh, decisive forehand going cross court. Let's see if we can get a smile out of Emma Miller. Usually throughout <laughs> most matches, she's smiling all the time, winning or losing. She's not playing her um, master's lob serve at the moment, no. so, oh, wow. That was a great little dink. I think Abby just needs to take a breather, take a little bit more time be between the games. Yep. Uh, rallies if she can. She's been hurried up a little bit, isn't yeah, she? Yeah, yeah. Well, and then we see that sort of error. That's probably the first um, error from Emma, I think, in this match. Well, I don't know about you, Shelley, but I'd quite like them to slow down because I've, <laughs> I've almost lost it. Oh, don't play. Oh, great shot by Emma. Yeah, wow. She's really not letting anything get behind her. She's trying to take everything on the, on the volley. Yeah. 
Here's the replay of that. Yeah, look at that, just on the volley, moving forward. Just um, too, oh. too fast for Abby at the moment. And there we go. That is the second game in quickfire fashion. 11-5, so two games is the winning point. Yeah, and great uh, shot. Usually what we're used to seeing is a lot of smiling from Emma Miller and uh, no questioning at all from Abby Palmer. In fact, it's very rare that she even questions any calls. She's done it just once so far in this match. And a two-game-to-love lead for Emma Miller, the top seed from the Waikato, against Abby Palmer, the second seed from the North Shore Club. Starting now on to the third game of this, the women's final, the national championships here at the North Shore Club. And Shelley Kitchen, great performance so far from Emma Miller. And uh, the let there, Shelley, what can Abby Palmer do? Does she just need to slow it down somehow? Yes, yes, she does. She needs to, um, like, that's a good shot, get the ball in the corners a little bit more. She's got to stop going short of Emma's short ball. If she can, she needs to get it out of the front when she can. And that was get the winning shot there. Yeah, she's using the high a little bit more in, in these couple of rallies. You know, but the rallies have got to be yeah, a, a little bit longer. Her retrieving probably has to be a little bit better um, at, at the moment. Oh, it's a great shot. There we go. There's the smile uh, from Emma Miller, albeit that it's a smile when she lost the point. Two love up. I'd, I'd smile if I was here <laughs> exactly. at this point. <laughs> exactly. Just once. Yeah. That's a beautiful lob. Somehow it stayed in. Mm, great shot. Yeah, I mean, firstly, for Abby to hit that shot off such a high lob yeah. is uh, fantastic. And then the reply, the response from Emma Miller, well, that was pretty decisive as well. Emma's moving really well. She's retrieving well. That's oh, a great shot by us down. Yep. And so Abby Palmer coming back into this particular game a lot stronger. And the ball fading a little bit there. Shelley, it has seemed to fade, for want of a better word, in the forehand corner a lot more than the backhand corner for some reason. Not sure why that is, but players have adjusted. Oh, wow. She's just on fire at the moment, Eva. Yeah. Eva, I think she's waiting, been waiting a long time <laughs> sort of, to be in this position. And just the raised eyebrows on that one. But probably a fair call. Yeah. Yeah, not much room room to play the ball. Wasn't it wasn't a tight shot and Abby was there to um play, so oh it's a great shot. Well, it hasn't been long. It's been some very decisive points for oh, that's nice So there's there's that shot that Abby you know going short off in a short ball. Yeah. Yeah. Just too much pace on that one as well. We're seeing some great attacking shots, very decisive. I think that's what you can say from uh, Emma Miller, although. Oh. So the error helps Abby Palmer just back into a little bit more. Yeah, this is a really yeah, crucial point in the rally, I think, for Abby. It's no. mm, good luck. So a little bit of a relief in a way, with the two-point buffer for Emma Miller, and straight away she's into it before you can even blink. Yeah. She's on to the next point. Yeah. She's not really giving it, it, Abby any kind of time to uh, gather herself. Oh, uh, her luck. Probably the right shot, but it's another, um, Emma's just making her um, play unforced errors at the moment. So as we get deeper into this, the third, with a two-game to love lead for Emma Miller, She's, that's out. She's so keen to get her name on that trophy, so keen to get on the honours board. 
It's been the last three years, Joelle King. Prior to that, there was uh, Megan Craig for one year. And uh, Joelle King up there oh, again. Oh, that shot. Nice play. And uh, the stroke. And here we go. This is the match ball championship ball. Both oh. trying to do lots of flex skills. <laughs> Oh, oh. Abby guessing right there. Oh. Great rally. Oh, oh wow. Nice great shot. Play. It's a hold off match ball. One match ball. The left hander stepping up and using the angle. Great play. Nice. Oh, well done. And that is it. Great game to Emma. And well done to. Emma Miller, the top seed from the Waikato, 11-8, 11-5, 11-6. She is the champion and first-time winner of the national title. And Shelly Kitchen, just a, a word there on that, that final. Emma Miller, just too fast, too good tonight. Yeah, she, she, yeah, she played really well. And now, ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome up the winner of the New Zealand title for the first time, Emma Miller.